<sighs> Yo, what's going on, everyone? We're back playing some Dark Souls 2. And, yeah, we... Um, sorry, I'm just focused on all these messages. Let's start a new game. <coughs> Excuse me. Perhaps you've seen. I'm gonna skip the cutscenes because, well, they're quite a while. They, they take quite a long time. And yeah, this is things for Twix. And yeah. I'm over here, I think there's a rustic coin. I should know this by now, you might have time to play this game. Yeah. And just by that waterfall there, there's a smooth and silky stone. And there's a few ways you can get to I never noticed what cave is. <coughs> yeah, that's so uh, used for something later. Once again, I'm gonna skip cutscene. That's what I'm gonna call a character. <laughs> At least. And let's be a sorcerer. Petrified something. Skinny mage sorcerer. Black hair. Her hair is there actually. Oh, no. I'm not sure that. Don't look right. I'm just gonna keep it as that. All these eyebrows are way too bushy. having a red tattoo. And let's finalize this. People come here for the <coughs> same reason to break no. the curse. Yep, and I know I'm gonna die many, many, many times and all of that, but I'm just trying to rush through the game. Like, I'm gonna complete everything in the game, but just rush through it, so like, I'm not really gonna explain everything. And only reason why I'm doing that is because the videos can only be 15 minutes long. And yeah. Alright, so hold on, let me just put this in there. That's how it should be the start. Over. Oh, I can 
do this. Back here, there's a. Uh, I, I don't know what it's called. I don't think anyone does. It's like a troll of some kind. Like, you can tell just by all these footprints. It usually tells you at the beginning of the game that you're not ready for this just yet. But. drops a stone ring and there used to be some gold pine resin I think it was anyway it, it was up here by a tree yeah and nothing over there nothing over there that's one of the ways you can get to that smooth and silky stone if you just drop down. <coughs> and the final way to get to that stone is if you were to jump from here, try and hit that tree and just fall, but I'm not going to attempt that. Right, let's go like the bonfire. Like the bag is so weak, it's, it's really crap. Oh, yeah, the only reason why I'm doing this is for more souls. I am just gonna be spamming this soul arrow as well. Except on this guy that's around this corner right here. That's what you learn the backstab. That's quite a bit of damage for a dagger. Is another dagger, of course. Archers annoy me. Take them out as quickly as possible. And this guy. Just eat all of that. Gem for 18 soul arrows left, and this is where the petrified something and smooth and silky stone come in handy. These two are so annoying. Let's leave them, remember to leave them, don't discard them. Some dead. No, demon's great hammer. Cool. Never had one of them before. Soul of the name of soldier. Let's go do this. Get a few more souls. Wow, 
fail. This dagger has so little reach, I'm not used to it. Yeah, this is the first time I've actually played a sorcerer class. I, I've tried it out before, but I used to think it was too um, campy and like not as close combat and it's not as fun to play. But, you know, since I'm doing a walkthrough, that's kind of what I want. It makes it easier for me to sort of, you know, beat the bosses um, and clear areas. I think that's one of the only people down here. Not too sure to be honest. Nope. Choose for invading people. Um, yeah, while well, they're playing the game, so that's always fun. I can basically come over here and see what's in that room. I think it's just um, Buffalo Leviathan. Oh, I think they're. Like, I'm not sure what they are. Basilisks. I think they're basilisks or something. You just got an archer over there shooting you. So that's always fun. But we can't go in there yet because that statue is blocking the way. We need a fragrant bunch of yore. <coughs> so we're just going to skip the rest of this area because we can't actually do it. Wow, so many messages. I wonder if my message is still here. Here's the first thing that you must do as a mage or spellcaster or archer of any kind. You need to come to this like little gap between the rocks here. You're gonna see an item over there. You just wanna drop down straight away. And you drop down again. And there's another item here, morning star and a cleric sacred chime. That they're, they're the items that you use if a cleric is your cleric highly important and you get the binoculars which are an essential necessity to do what we need to do right, let's just you know, save we're off a forest are you the next monarch but I will rem go on. I right, got an essence for us. There, seek the there. One yeah, only level up. But all right. What do we need? All right, how much does it cost to level up? Eight hundred and fifty-four. Let's get one level of attunement. Yeah. The reason why I got that is because that eventually lets me um, carry more spells. Like the next thing you want to do once you can carry more spells is buy enough 30 soul arrows. That's really useful, actually. And one just not exactly the time to be well, chatting with a cat. Well, so ooh. I'm talking to Shaoqua and yeah, he, she is on the other side of this wall. Nothing suited you, I presume. No, I didn't. Well, that's dismissed. Got a life jam. <laughs> 